Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here and welcome back to our Town Hall 8 Let's Play where guys, all five builders are done. I filmed yesterday and so this P.E.K.K.A upgrade still has another 22-24 hours left to go. So, we don't have to worry about the laboratory today, but we are going to make some more insane defense progress as usual. Okay, sound good? Yes, of course it does. So, we're going to smack some bases with hogs as usual because they have proven to be the best and I love it. I, have, I absolutely love attacking I actually have to I actually have to convince myself not to attack because if I if I leave it to my own devices I'll only attack on this account because you know it's just I just love using hogs and I probably should use hogs more on the other accounts that I play but I don't because I, I just I have certain strategies I know work on each town hall level and I know the hogs work really well at town hall 8 so uh yeah that's that's my problem so I've actually like had to tell myself not to attack because I don't want to max out my loot and then have max loot when I start a video that's boring I got to do my raids and or I have to do my upgrades at the beginning of the video and not at the end I mean how how else how else am I going to entice you guys to watch a 10 minute YouTube video than to then to dangle the upgrades in front of your eyes and say you gotta wait till the end of course honestly in the Yesterday's video didn't follow that rule. <laughs> they, they rarely ever follow that rule. I'm just I'm just talking. You guys know me. I'm just just rambling on as I try to find a base. So, uh, guys, I'll be right back once I find a perfect base. In the meantime, do not forget to like, subscribe, and join the Klaus family for daily gaming videos. And if you consider using code Klaus when you buy something, that would be amazing as well. Okay, 450,000 gold. It's actually not bad. And I notice I'm only focusing on that because that's really all I need now. So, question. Bomb tower. There it is. Okay. I think... Ooh, actually, I think I could take out two wizard towers with my golem. And that's how I decide my entry point. I look at where the wizard towers and the bomb towers are. And I'm trying to take out two of them. I don't care what they are. Bomb tower, ideally. Uh, wizard tower, if I can take out two of them at the same time, that'd be great too. So, let's put the golem in the middle. There we go, I got them both distracted. And if I drop a wizard on either side, I'm actually going to kill them both, just with wizards. That's pretty sweet. Alright, bowlers, uh, get in there with the king. And let's drop the wall breakers as well, just for the fun of it. And a couple more wizards. There we go. Alright, raid spell on the bowlers. And then let's send the hogs out in front. I've also got some corner buildings I should take out with my archers. And I'm going to put a couple of wizards in behind as well. All right, poison over the king, uh, heal into the core. I haven't healed my hogs in a while. That's because we did such a great job taking out the splash damage. I don't really have to think about it or worry about it. Uh, let's drop another heal out here because of the wizard tower, and that should be it. That should be done, Zo. Uh, all I need to do now is pop the king's ability, maybe get the other archers, focus on a couple things, and uh, there you go, three star. See, gotta love it. I, I, I love it. <laughs> And again, it's all about, it's really about that golem. If you can get that golem with the bowlers and the king to focus on two of those four defenses, and you usually can find a good spot for that in every base, then you're done. You don't have to worry about it anymore. You just, I mean, obviously you have to do everything else. You have to focus. You have to get your hogs in there and heal them and all that stuff. Rage up the bowlers in the core. But that's really the key. Get two wizard towers or a wizard tower and a bomb tower and... You're good. Your hogs should be fine. So there we go. 468,000 gold. And I've got another set of hogs. So that's awesome. I'm going to wait about 15 seconds. Let's go do one raid of uh, baby dragon action here. Uh, I don't even know what I'm trying to do next. I, I always forget. But let's do a raid really quickly. My king only had like 20 seconds left before he was awake. And I want to do another raid pretty quickly today. So, okay. So baby dragons clearing up the outside. Let's actually send in the uh the battle machine out here okay i want to get that double cannon down there we go perfect the battle machine is now entering the base this is looking really good here's the ability going to take out the firecracker very nice there we go so that's two of them down uh let's take out that double cannon and that archer tower and also the giant cannon we got baby dragons all over the place. I forget that I've got extra baby dragons. I'm being so conservative with them right now. Which, you know, I like to be smart with my stuff, but uh, I've got so many baby dragons, I should be totally fine. Um, okay, so Firecracker is going to be the last defense to go down. And then as long as I get this Tesla down pretty quickly, I think I've just pulled off the triple here, guys. 
Uh, that roast was going to be a problem, but this other backup baby dragon may be able to stop things. Come on, Tesla, go down. Tesla, go down. No! Okay, no, we didn't get that three star. Dang it! <laughs> so close. Not bad for really just going in and just YOLOing. That's, that's not too bad. So let's see, we got 93% two star. We already passed that time for them. So, ooh, oh my gosh, okay. Wow. Oh, they got the three star. Nice. Okay, so they had a few, uh, a few bats survive and no more air targeting defenses. So GG's, they won. It was close though. If I, if I had just had like one more shot on that Tesla, that would have been a win for me. That would have been super cool. But, you know, it is what it is. Yep. Defeat. So what do I want to do here, guys? Uh, remember, I'm trying to upgrade the baby dragons. I remembered now. So I could do a defensive upgrade. I mean, that would not be a bad thing. We do some storages. Okay, I've actually maxed out my storages. What about my collectors? Yes. Okay, so all those are done. So let's upgrade. Oh, no, you know what I'm doing? I'm waiting. I'm, I'm trying to get to 2 million gold so I can get the other giant cannon. Nice. Okay, so I've just got to save up my loot. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to save up my loot. Lame, I know, but, you know, this isn't a baby. Uh, this isn't a builder-based playlist, and you know that. It's just kind of like, oh, let's check out what's going on with builder base today. All right, so I've got CC. I think it's just one Barbarian. I've got my King, and I've got the Hogs. So I think this will go decently well. I don't know. I found a base, though. Town on 9, super quickly. 600,000 gold. So this is going to be just like the last time where I found a base where I don't think I'm going to build a 3-star, but I do want to make sure I at least get all the gold, and it's all in one spot. So it should be fine. Dark Elixir over here. That'd probably be a good thing for me to start trying to make sure I max out my Dark Elixir for whenever I go to Town Hall 9. I'm going to need a crazy amount of Dark Elixir for Town Hall 9. So, yeah. Something to look forward to, I guess. Uh, Alright, so. Let's uh, let's get a couple wizards on uh, all three sides out here. I'm going to go one, one, two, three, four. There we go. Wall Breakers have been deployed. Let's get the king. And I'm pretty sure... Yeah, it's just one... one one little barbarian in my CC, so I'm not gonna worry too much about that. Uh, let's get the uh, let's get the hogs to go straight in behind the king. So everybody's kind of working together here. We got a queen. We got to watch out for. That's gonna be the main thing. Watch out for the queen. So, and I'm not really worried too much about healing just yet. Okay, yeah, right there. Boom. Let's actually rage into the core. I'm gonna poison the queen. There we go. Looking good. King's up there. He's level 19 as well. So I'm going to just watch over the main group here. This is not going to go well. <laughs> Down on nines are rough, bro. They're rough. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, poison the queen again. At least the king is going to get the dark elixir drill. At least the king's going to get that. Let's get the archers in there. Pop the king's ability. Maybe he'll be able to get through the wall. Uh, the wizards are getting the Dark Elixir out of the uh, the storage. That's not bad. And the king actually managed to get to the queen. Okay, all right. I'm feeling a little bit better now. I got all the gold. I don't need the elixir. So really, the only thing I'm kind of regretting is not getting the storage. But I didn't really plan to. I didn't expect to. So I'm not sorry or anything. I'm good. I'm good. I'm happy. I'm happy with how things went down. Uh, all right, so... Uh, yeah, I mean, oh wow, that wizard. Actually, that golem is taking tons of damage right now, man. If I had a wizard behind here, I've got some archers, but if I had a wizard, I might actually get all that gold. Nice. See, it's the power of the hogs. I mean, it really is all about the hogs. They, they're just absolute beasts. So, Archer Tower takes out the last archer, and that is the game. All right, let's go ahead and close out. And uh, there you go. That loot bonus is still over half a million gold. Not bad. And a lot of Dark Elixir. I'm not going to complain about that. 4,696 Dark Elixir. Not too bad. And thank you for the bowlers, Maltimax. I will definitely use them in my next raid. Just not on video. Sorry. All right. So let's do this now. I'm just thinking out loud here. Uh, let's go into the progress base and stare at what's going on here. So I got these three Teslas. 1.3, 1.3, and 1.5. So that is 3. 11. So 4.1. Yeah, yeah. So do to, to do all three of these Teslas, it'd be 4.1 million gold. Which I don't have. I do actually. I have enough gold to do it. If I collect this gold, I do have 4.1 million, but that'll only be three builders. So let's do this. Let's do these two Teslas. 
just to get them all the same level. It kind of bothers me that they're not the same level anyway, right? So one day upgrade, 1.3 million gold, 3, 2, 1, bam, and 3, 2, 1, bam. Okay. Next priority, giant bomb. Let's go ahead and max this one out too, okay? And I've got enough loot to do it. So 600,000 gold, 3, 2, 1, bam. And I, again, that one's maxed out, right? I don't remember. It was over there. Yeah, that's where the other one is. So let's just slip that one in that little spot. That's perfect right there. Okay, so now uh, the next top priority would be, I'm guessing, bombs. I mean, if you think about it, the bombs do a lot of damage to hogs. Uh, or spring traps. Let's see. This spring trap goes from 12 to 14. That makes no difference for hogs because they're an interval of five. So spring trap's not really that big of a deal. The skeleton trap actually is a big, big, big deal because it is such a pain to deal with. <laughs> So actually, I think I should max up the skeleton trap. See, I had no clue this was coming today. This is one of the, my favorite things about filming Clash of Clans is, yeah, I'll have everything planned out, but then something is going to surprise me. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I should do that. So let's do this, guys. 4.5 million gold, uh, both of the skeleton trap. Oh, wait, well, sorry. 450,000 gold. That would have been sad. 4.5 million gold for skeleton trap at Town Hall 8. Can you imagine how miserable that would be? <laughs> Nobody would ever upgrade their skeleton traps, ever. So, 450,000 gold, 5 hour upgrade, 3, 2, 1, bam! And I'm pretty confident that's maxed out, but I don't know for sure. And then this one will also be 450,000, which means I'll have an extra 200,000. So let's do one wall. Just like so, and bam. There we go. Nice! Okay, so we're working on these things now, guys. We got the skeleton traps done and out of the way. These Teslas will all have one level to go until they're done. And then it's really just down to a few key defenses and traps. And we are absolutely killing it, guys. Absolutely killing it. Town Hall 8 Let's Play roaring wildly. Like a lion, just roaring. For no reason. Why would why would a lion do that? Just to be, to be cool, right? Because that roar is pretty epic. Have you ever heard it? It's pretty sweet. So anyway, guys, tunnel eight, let's play, killing it. Um, next time we'll be uh, we'll have the P.E.K.K.A. done. So I don't know if we'll use it next episode, but it will be done. We'll have to do another laboratory upgrade and continue to work on defenses. All these upgrades are within 24 hours, so I might film tomorrow. Who knows? In the meantime, though, guys, that is going to be it for me today in this episode of our Tunnel 8 Let's Play. Be sure to like the video if you liked it. Subscribe to the Klaus family for daily gaming videos and ring that bell for notifications. And don't forget to use code Klaus if you guys decide to buy something in the game. Just remember that the code uh, gives a small percentage of your purchase to that content creator that you chose to support by using their code. So it's a huge blessing and a huge help for us content creators. So thank you all so much for doing that. And remember that the code does expire after seven days. So go into your shop, look for your little white C which is right there on the top right-hand corner. If you do have it, then you're golden, you're good. Go ahead and make your purchase. If it's gone, then that means you need to input the code again because it's expired. So uh, you can do that with the, the link in the description, which is automatic on your mold, mobile device, or you could do it manually in your settings. And that's the way I do it. So that's the thing. And also don't forget that you can uh, do the code in every single Supercell game, not just Clash of Clans. So if you uh, buy something, do consider using code Klaus. Guys, remember that I love each and every one of you, and I will see you all again next time.